the saddle so that it can't escape. Sorry, one more time? Nothing. Okay. Well, um, he's planning to destroy my bird and remove the saddle, and welcome back, everybody, to another MO7 Productions. Today, I am here with you with an Ark Survival Evolved. I am still lost. You are here with nothing. That is what you are here with. That sounds about right. Okay, so there's the tech stego. I bet this is the water I normally f normally drink out of. If that's the case, then that right there is a rock. And that's exactly where I'm at. Okay, I found home. Gosh darn it, you're at home, I bet. Meaning you're gonna kill me. Oh no, it stopped. Okay. I thought I crashed again. <laughs> no. No, your destruction will come when I deem it. Okay. Um. So, blueprint. So it's a blueprint. Journeyman Car Carabummy's Saddle. It's a journeyman carbo nemesis saddle. It's a turtle saddle. There's really no use to having it unless we're trying to make a tank carbo. This Which ain't this ain't something I can means... learn though, is it? Like this ain't something I'll, this ain't something I learn. No, you could learn it if you wanted. It's just a saddle for a turtle. How do I learn it? I've double clicked on it, just put it in my inventory. Oh, no, no. I mean, you can learn it as a normal Ingram. Yeah, I'm talking about this one. Oh, no, you can't learn blueprints. I learned one? It gave me an Ingram. No. It was now, it was. It was the Shag Carpet Ingram. I found that in a drop. Yeah. You, you can't. You can't learn Shag Carpeting. As in, you can't learn shag carpeting as a blueprint. You can learn it as an ingram, but not as a blueprint. All right, so that means I picked up an ingram for the shag carpet, not as not, you, not the blueprint. No, you picked up a blueprint for the shag carpeting. Which means now I can learn it. No, it means you can learn it at any... Okay, let me try and explain the difference in a way for anyone uh -huh. like you to understand. Okay. Okay, an ingram is something that you can learn. At any time. I'm aware of what I'm aware place, of what they as long are. As you're the right level. No, well, I, if you went to a drop uh -huh. and you saw what looked to be an Ingram for a shag carpet, uh -huh. you did not actually learn it. Okay, what did I do then? You just wound up picking up a blueprint for it. No, it um disappeared when I picked it up and the whole thing disappeared with it. Oh no, no, you're right, I'm just stupid. Gosh yeah. darn it, what the hell? Okay, so what do I do with this then? Shove it in a chest somewhere. Like, what's the The point? day you would need it, which will be never. Then what is the point of it? It's called a fucking blueprint, you idiot. You need it when you need it. You so don't that... have the resources to make anything with it, and, well, you honestly don't have a use for it right now because, well, you don't have anything to shag on. Mm -hmm. my, my. So then what is the point of the blueprints exactly? So if you don't learn them as of, like, you don't use them like, okay. almost like they're Let Ingram. let me repeat myself for the upteenth time. You remember how I said you only have a limited amount of Yes, I remember this. Yes, I know that. I know, and you said... Up. Yes, okay. and you... Hold on. Well, you let's said... Say you've already learned everything that you can. Yes, and you could get more with the blueprints. But how does that work, then, if you don't learn them as, like, almost like they were an Ingram? You, you... Okay, okay. Let, let me explain something. Let's say you're an engineer. Yeah. You're an engineer who knows all about how to make one specific type of boat, okay? Sure, yeah. I'm following. Okay. And then somebody shows up with a blueprint, uh -huh. a physical design on a piece of paper 
that outlined specifically how to make a different kind of boat that you did not previously know how to make. Okay. And that an idiot with basic level knowledge could follow this said blueprint and create a working boat. That is what it is for. So instead of like unlocking it almost like an Ingram would, you just kind of put it in the crafting thing then? Yes, and make shit using it, yes. And usually you can get higher quality items by making them using it with blueprints, you know? Yeah. Okay, so it's just like throw it in the smithy kind of thing then. So I'm not doing uh, that for either those. Either that or just shove it in a chest because it takes up space for crafting ingredients. Again, it's one of those things that you only need it once you need it. Yeah. Like, let's say you just tamed an animal and you're all out of uh, ingrams for that particular animal. Yep. Uh, saddle? Well, then don't worry, because you can make it anyway. Hmm. So I haven't been able to find any good thylas. Don't want to have to go all the way to the uh, redwood forest up north to hunt for one. That sucks then. But it looks like I'm going to have to. It's a long and perilous journey, Charlie Zard. Which is why I'm going to make you do it. Ah, oh, gosh darn it. <laughs> No, it's actually far too serious a task to entrust to a Charlie's art. I was about to say, do you really want me doing that? So, how was your day? Yeah, not awesome. Not awesome? Well, that ain't good. Well, I mean, not awesome's okay, because it's my off day. That's true. Yeah, I just get to lay around and take a nap and try and rest and relax when I don't have some jackass talking at me. So what do they have you do there? Fold bags. That's it? Just fold them? Well, I mean, sometimes we pleat them apart from other bags. Sometimes we look at them and see if there are defects. Sometimes we box them. Sometimes we bag them in other bags. Huh. It's, it's a bag processing facility. Yeah, basically. I know. Found another uh, thyla, but it was once again a low level. I don't think we'll actually be able to tame a Thyla anytime soon because they're always low levels. See, uh, the Argent doesn't have enough health. Okay. And since it doesn't have enough health, it won't survive the trip all the way from the Redwoods. Yeah. While holding something constantly biting at its legs. I can believe that. So the horse, one of the wild horses is stuck between a rock and the parasaur right now. Yeah, don't worry about it. I know, but he's sitting there trying to constantly run. It's kind of entertaining, but he's just stuck there. And? Oh, it's just kind of funny. You scared him in here and he got stuck there after you scared him. Mm-hmm. Well, that's what happens. 
Yes, it is. <laughs> On my way back, I'm flying. Good for you. I'm on the way to come and stab a Charlie. I'm sure you stab me good now. Oh, he got out. Now I'm going to stab him bad. I'm just going to eat 400 uh, cactus sap. This reminds me of Avatar The Last Airbender. I'm not sucking on cactus, damn it. I ain't doing By that. By every definition, you are. Shut up. <laughs> I know. I know Drink I cactus juice. It'll quench you. It's the quenchiest. Mmm, water. The nectar of the gods. Water is definitely not the nectar of the gods. It's a joke. Really bad joke, but it's uh, for a completely different YouTuber joke. No, it still sucks, even then. Yeah, I know that, but it's a YouTuber I follow plays that a lot. Well, not a lot, he plays it every now and then. Anytime someone mentions water. And what's bad, so he's got one of those, uh, those play deck boards or whatever it is. I can't think of what they're called. Um... And, um, he's got one labeled water. Well, it's not the right one. It's just, it's the water drop. Where it's, like, dripping into, like, a sink or something. So, what always ends up happening is he plays the wrong one, and then he ends up playing that, because that's the one he's looking for. He does, uh, he does Pokemon challenges every week. And during the week he does, um, things like, uh, Mario Party. And, um, lately it's been Mystery Dungeon along with it. Which has been entertaining for me. Is it going to be entertaining for you when you are impaled upon a spear? Probably. Just a little. Let us test this theory. I really wish we would. Can we not do that, please? Well, too bad I'm not a genie. I don't grant wishes. Sure? Are you sure you're not a genie in a bottle, baby? I'm sorry, did you just call me a baby? Yeah, do you not know that song? I really hope you know that song. I know it's a little older than us, but it's a good song. Unfortunately, I believe it is by Britney Spears, I think. And now it's stuck in my head. You're awful quiet, so that has me looking up, looking for you. And wondering what the hell that is. The hell is that? Huh? Huh. So, uh, there's a... S hold on, hold, hold up, Alex. Hold, hold up, shit, drop me. I, I got a question. Drop me. Drop me, seriously. No, no I, I have a legit question on what the hell something is up in the sky. So, towards the red obelisk at the beam, there's just a white pixel square. What the hell is that? I don't know. Don't know? What are you doing? I'm carrying you to a place where you will most likely die instantly. You realize I've got a, the ghillie suit in my inventory, right? Don't care. Why would you gonna kill me? Because you clearly... Hey, there's a wolf me. there. There's a wolf there. I know. I don't want to leave you just at the wolves. I'm going to leave you right here. No. In the middle of the large no. pile of carnotaurs and yeah. scorpions. Uh. 
and Sabertooth. Oh, and not oh, to mention Sunday, those guys. Toothy, Sabertooth. There's also those uh, big old armadillo looking guys that would just eat the shit out of me. And you left me here, thanks. No, it's because I ran out of stamina. In a few moments, I'll catch you again. No. Oh, and you see those white rocks that don't look like they belong? Um, I'm looking for them, but I know they're here. Cause I know there's a rock golem over here somewhere. Yeah, those are the rock golems. I know. I'm trying to see it from here. I just can't. How can you not see it? Because I'm not spotting it. You're not seeing those white rocks right there and right there. Here, let me demonstrate. I honestly can't can't say I can. I do see a water vein. The one right right here next to the water vein. Yep, there he is. See I put my I put my scope on it and it didn't show it. It just showed the water vein. Yep, that's the one I found earlier was that one. And they're all chasing us. There are two Carnotaurs down there. So, uh, what does it take to kill a rock gold? A lot. Okay. What do they give? Not much. So, it's not worth killing, then. Gosh darn. I have a feeling we're pretty well protected in this canyon, if that's what's all around us. Most tribes have flyers before they move inland. Now the, now the square's gone. No, it's just higher up now. Hi there, buddy. Okay, I got it out. Let's get him. No. <laughs> You'd kill it before knocking it out. I wasn't trying to. I wanted to kill it. What's the use of killing a level 95 Quetzal? Uh, to eat it. Duh. Maybe. I don't know. There's better things to eat. I know. We could always eat this Parasaur. Looks so delicious. Ow. Wrong one. Why are you looking at me so hard? I don't like this. Just the... It's just there. And now for the taming of the chart. Come here. I don't land you, stupid bird. Honey, I'm home. No, no. Ah, oh, damn it. Back to the valley of death he goes. Oh. <laughs> Gosh darn it. <laughs> oh, is he following me? Is my bird still following me? Yeah, but I stopped him. Okay, good. This okay. time I am actually dropping him. In. No. Why? Because you keep doing everything in your power to annoy me. I really haven't been. Haven't you? No, I'm not trying to. Okay, those two have been fighting forever. That's because they're never going to kill each other. Their turning radiuses are too wise. Or wide, rather. I'd say let's kill one of them and then kill the other one afterwards, but no, that would just be a bad idea because then as soon as we kill the one, the other one's going to come for us, not to mention as soon as we hit one, it's going to also target us. Why do predators not target other predators? Uh, because sometimes it's an evolutionary instinct thing. Where are we going? Oh, uh, we're going to where I look for Thylacaleos. And I think I just crashed. Uh, I hope not, because you're still flying. This is 
really gonna suck if you did. Yep. Where'd you crash to? Oh my god. This is a really bad place to be crashing, Alex. I'm logging back in. Hold on, I'm launching. Oh out. god. I'm hitting the ground. Please don't. No, not here. I mean, Charlie. at least it looks safe. But. Charlie. Okay, good. You're not dropping me through the ground. Um. We're in another canyon. And I don't exactly know how far from the wyvern nest we are, nor if we are in the griffin nest. Currently, I don't Charlie, know if we are. We're not in the wyvern or griffin nest, you idiot. I just told you where the fuck we were. And as soon as I manage to log back in, I'll get us back out. I'm just happy you didn't drop me at any point in here. Probably happen as soon as I try and log back in. I hope not. Hmm. Currently acts as if you're still logged in, though. Yeah, it'll take a minute or two for it to figure it out. I know when it did that to me, it threw an error of um. Of uh, this player's already logged in. So I wonder what the max level of the dinosaurs are here. It's 150. What's the max level after you tame them that you can get get them up to? 225. Well, actually, hold on. After you tame the dinosaur, if you get 100% um, efficiency uh, on a level 150, it'll be level 225. Yeah. And then I believe you can get 75 more levels. Or 73, 70-something levels. So probably up to 300 then. For, right. ma for math sakes. Yeah. Yes, you, yes, for a normal dino. However... In the odd chance that you get a hold of a pair of dinosaurs and you start breeding them together, if their best stats stack on top of each other, you may get a dinosaur that is higher in stats than both the parents and therefore higher level. Mm. That is where dinosaur breeding comes in. So, did you know you could just get 200 polymer for 50 um, store credits? Yeah, I did. We just don't have a use for polymer right now. Okay. Yeah, already a player with this account connected. I'm gonna have to restart ARC again. Are you still in the uh, Argentavis' claws? Yes, I am. Hmm. I'll probably be dropped when uh, you log out or when it kicks you out, won't it? Oh, yeah. You may have to completely reboot ARC. You know. You may be able to get the bird to go where you want. I have, like, no control. Uh, have you tried whistling? Yes, I am currently actually oh, trying Oh, right, that. right. Um, yeah, right, because as long as I'm still on there, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no, you, you'll die, probably. Uh, oh, um, possible to be close. And you... Logged out? Oh, that's a lot fucking higher than I thought it was. Mm -hmm. 
Well, don't worry. As soon as you log in, don't panic. <sighs> yeah, just go to the ground and pick up my stuff. If uh, you'd like to, maybe just spam your open inventory key a few times. Huh? On the way down? No, I've already died. Oh, you already you, died. Yeah. I think as soon as you... I'm assuming you're, you were starting ARC. Uh, no, I'm logging no. in right now. Okay, well, immediately go down and pick up my shit. <laughs> Just so you know. I died right Yeah, let, let's see if the spam inventory key trick still works. Don't know. So did you know you could also buy a golem in the shop? Yes, Charlie. I knew all of this. Congratulations. You're continuing to miss the point of the damn game. Yeah, I know. I was just kind of looking at it for interest sakes while I was stuck in your hands. Hmm. All right. D2 underscore F3. Oh, never mind. Uh, yeah, I'm safe on the ground. Thankfully, when I ragdolled, I fell straight to the floor and was unharmed. Yeah, because you seem to be immune to ragdolling. As, uh, I mean, immune to fall damage as a ragdoll. Hmm, let's see. Here's a dead Charlie. Hmm. Let's ransack his belongings and disrespect his body in a marionette-like fashion. Okay. In the meantime, let me check and see if there are any new Thylacaleos in this area. I'm just going to harvest some berries. I kind of want a frog. Hmm. Well, how curious. You kind of won't get a, a frog. Oh no, there's one right here next to me. Do you know how to tame it? I don't remember, no. Exactly. A lot of people logging in all of a sudden. Oh, game stopped again. Imagination. I may have time to Imagination. Count. Imagination. Uh, Imagination. 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 Fatal error. Wait, what? Fatal error. Oh, so your game crashed too, huh? Uh, no, like. The game is closing crashed to desktop. Yeah I, know. yeah, I know. Is that how badly you crashed too? Yep. Oh. Um, now I got to convince Steam that um, it's not running anymore. I think Steam no, may have actually crashed for it'll me. Take a, it'll take a minute for that to happen. Don't worry about it. Uh, a lot of things are crashing all of a sudden. Yeah, your soul, your mind, your perception of reality, your computer, your game. Yeah. Oh, it gets uh, actually pretty bad. Even Bitdefender has stopped responding. Hmm. Huh. 
So until we get this uh, settled, I'm going to end this episode, y'all. Y'all have a good you, day. You make you make it sound like there's some kind of argument to settle. No, no I'm talking about like actually getting things to go again. All right, we will see you in the next episode. Bye. Here I go again on 